Hey guys, it's Danielle here. Welcome back to my channel, Uniquely Nicole. Yay. So guys, we are on day four, yes, of doing my natural hair every single day for a week. And yesterday I did Bantu knots and I let them be free. And here is the result after I went to bed, decided to put my hair in like a little puff ball. And now we're awake and ready to go and do the next hairstyle. So I wanted to explain to you guys what I had in mind. So I was thinking, since I didn't get to do space buns yesterday, I'm gonna do space buns today. So I wanted to add a little bit of color. So I'm gonna add some, probably some blonde hair and some red auburn hair to my space buns in the back and add a cute little braid and see how that goes. It's gonna be very interesting detangling my hair after having Bantu knots in and sleeping in them. I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you like it, please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Leave your comments in the bottom. Oh, sorry, I was doing so well. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit the bell. You know, when you wanna see these videos, you can just get them in an instant. You'll have a notification. And don't forget to comment down below any other ideas or inspiration you have for me when I'm doing my hair for the next three days. We have three days left. I'm so <sighs> relieved, but also so sad because this actually has been a lot of fun. Uh, let's go to my bathroom. <laughs> so hey guys, welcome to my bathroom. This is like a different angle. I don't know if I like it or not. I feel like you guys are, I don't know. If, if you like this angle, just let me know. <laughs> so here I am in the bathroom with the hair puff. So, you guys know the drill. You guys know the drill. We gotta do the snap. Here we go. This is definitely a different camera angle again. Sorry. <laughs> so, here's my hair. I just put water on it and you finger detangled it once again. That's what you gotta do. You gotta do what you gotta do. Now I'm going to moisturize it so it'll be easier to part with my fingers and then a comb and then we're gonna grab all the things i need to do this hairstyle and i'll show you guys let's do it so for my hair it's not super straight but it's really hard to make sure that both of these are even in lines but that's the best i can do with parting behind me so with this section of hair i'm going to put some gel on it, some aloe vera, mango and aloe to help define my curls. Let's add some water to make braiding a little bit easier. Use a hair tie, I have another one. Well, this is a hair band, but it's a lot easier to stretch into a hair tie because I don't have any hair ties because hashtag we inside. <laughs> I'm gonna grab some hair to braid in. Let me grab that. There's some of the pieces that I already had that were pre-cut. So I'm just gonna braid them into my hair. Make sure to divide them before you start because I'm gonna do like feed in braids, which I'm not, I haven't mastered yet. So there won't be a tutorial on that yet, but it's really fun to try out. And like I said, practice makes perfect. Why I like using like different colored hair is because I don't wanna dye my hair at least yet. So I think it's really fun to add different colors to your hair without having the commitment of it or the damage of it. So I think this would be really cute with my look. Let's get started. All right, first things first. What I love about my hair. I love how unique and different my hair is. Although our hair has certain curl patterns, there is none and nothing like it. And I love it so much. So there are two ways you can do this. You can either braid from top to bottom, or you can braid, braid from bottom to top. It depends on how you want your bun. So if you want your buns in the back, you start from top to bottom. If you want your buns on top, you start from bottom to top. I actually like braiding both ways, but I'm challenging myself to go from bottom to top. So let's see how that goes. So funny thing, while I was recording this video, in my head, I was like, oh my gosh, I don't remember this being so hard. So if you see me struggling, it's because it's been a while since I braided my hair like this. Now to add in some hair. 
So I know in my previous video I said today was going to be wash day, but due to my procrastination, I'm hopefully going to have wash day on Saturday. Um, a funny story is when I was little, when my grandma used to wash my hair, every time we would wash it because it would be a whole process, she would be like, oh, I hope I didn't drown you. And every time I referred to washing my hair, I referred to it as, oh, going to go drown myself because... It's a pretty fun memory of having someone else wash your hair. All right, that was a lot. Let's see how it looks. I'm, I'm high piece here. Oh, that doesn't look too bad. This does not look too bad. I should have added the hair a little bit sooner, but I just always want to start off with a good base. So I, so my braiding pattern will stay nice and well. But yeah, I'm gonna wrap this real quick. It's not gonna stay like this, but that's. That's pretty good for like, oh, I was scared. I was really scared for a moment. Okay, let's do the other side of my hair. <sighs> okay, so this is going to be great. I'm really excited right now. And like the twists that I just did, I'm going to make sure to incorporate them with the bun. <laughs> Yay! I'm really excited. Let's do the next section of hair. If you guys have any funny stories of maybe getting your hair done or any horror stories please leave them in the comments down below i love to read them i read every single comment and like every single comment so don't be afraid it'll be great also i'm sorry that i'm not really centered framed when braiding my hair behind i was super concentrated so i didn't realize you can't see any of it my apologies in advance another success of here. I didn't make this one look as long as big as a piece as I did or long as the left side the braid. There you go. So now time to divide these guys. A little twists on the top. <laughs> so I'm just going to guesstimate these go over here, those ones go over there. And with this hair, I'm going to just twist my twists around. You could just have like a random braid like this just sticking out. <laughs> And that could be your hairstyle if you like. It's your choice. It's all about the creativity. I actually did not check this braid. Let me check this braid. Parting isn't as good, but I think this side looks so, like, I think this side looks a lot better than this side. I think because I did this one straighter. Oh, I don't know if you guys can see this stuff. I did this braid a lot straighter than this braid because it goes like a little wave. That's what you're going for. You got it. There it is. <laughs> but I was trying to go for something to look a little bit more alike. So I wrapped it that one. There you go. Um, you can leave it like this if you'd like. But if that's what you're looking for, you got it. Add more bobby pins to secure this little twist and all the twists that are hanging on. <laughs> So yeah, if you guys want this, you can do this. I know this isn't straight because I'm not done with it. So I'm just like, make it look prettier and then it can be your own hairstyle. Cause this is a, this is a look. This is a look guys. I'm totally down for this look. A little extra. So I have some hair that I might just like go into and wrap around. So I'll be right back. I just have like a bunch of blonde hair because I braided my hair one day. And I added a bunch of like colors trying to do a Beyonce like style. So I have just a bunch of blonde hair everywhere. So I'm going to grab some like hair ties, wrap it around these little parts and wrap them around my buns. Okay, I'm back. So I have like these little rubber band hair ties. If you know them, you know them. Is I'm going to, sorry, I just ran down the stairs. I ran up the stairs, I ran back down the stairs. So if I'm out of breath, sorry. You're going to go like this. I hope you can see this. My hands are very big. Go like that. And for this ponytail, you just put it around there. Ooh. 
and just wrap it around <laughs> like so make it as big as you want and it's okay if like it's okay if the brown shows on or your hair your real color share shows because it is supposed to be like a blend of colors so Ooh. <laughs> all right next one look how just that like look at the difference like doing the same thing rubber band hopefully this one doesn't pop these rubber bands are notorious for popping so i'm like flinching a little bit because i've been through some stuff <laughs> and i'm just wrapping it around my little butt oh gosh nope not that not like that <laughs> make sure you're not going into your scalp when you're bobby pinning i have a sensitive scalp it hurts so just save your scalp this looks kind of crazy because it's just like two little blonde buns on top of like extremely dark hair <laughs> call me mickey mouse bro i'll be mickey mouse this is my last bobby pin this better make the look i think that's the best we're gonna get them right now because they're not gonna be like super even in size but look they're gonna be like kind of messy <laughs> don't hate that look they're kind of like little scoops of vanilla. <laughs> TBH. <laughs> I think I, I think this is it. I think this is all we can do. Like, oh my gosh. This is like crazy. I've never done anything like this before. So I'm like 100% shook. This is what it looks like. I think, I don't know what else to do. I, I feel like I'm going to play in my hair all day to make it the most it can be, the best it can be. Are these even? I'm gonna take a picture. I'm gonna take a picture and be right back. And I bet you it's not gonna be even, but it sure does look cute. Look at this! No, this side, this side is what I think what's throwing me off. This side, my right side, like I told you. I don't know if I did tell you guys, but I have a weird thing about me the left side of my hair always looks better than the right my right side of my hair always is it's weird it's weird but my left side always looks better so as you can see here is my point prove it <laughs> cute <laughs> it could be better really i don't know what else to do to make them even <laughs> okay i'll be right back Hey guys, I did take a picture and I decided to change up the scenery for the so long, farewell, Alvita saying good night, goodbye, good morning, I don't know what time it is. Anyway, I think I like low-key fixed them, I don't know. This is the end result of my hair, I think this is really cute. Um, the hair blonde with the black is kind of like a punch in the face, but I'm totally vibing with it. Like dare to be different i guess i don't know this i've never done something like this before i had something in my head i envisioned something and it turned completely different from what i envisioned and i kind of love it so this is what you get when danielle is running out of ideas and her ideas that she thought she wanted change and you get this so i hope you guys like this video and enjoyed it Ooh. I tried to like, I felt my inner like dark girl, goth girl today, so I threw on the black shirt. I was like, let's keep these star earrings in. I did some eyeliner. I did the freckles. I was like, we're going to be a goth. And this hair turned out like right on point with like a goth Barbie. I don't know. I don't know. Tell me what you guys think in the comments. Don't forget to give this video a big old like and don't forget to subscribe if you want more hair content. And don't forget to hit that bell. Get that bell, hit it, punch it, do what you need. And I'll see you guys next time. I love you so very much. And also, hello to all the new subscribers. Thank you for all your comments and all your likes. It means so much to see that you guys actually like this video and that people are actually watching because it's a time. <laughs> see you guys later.